In this video, we'll uncover the most common mistakes that ruin your audio quality. Tip number four is a lack of pop filters and getting your wires crossed. So if you're outside, definitely put one of these socks on your microphones to stop the wind and the blowing. And generally, if you're recording in a studio, have a pop filter in front of your microphone. Or even better, if you don't want to have the pop filter, just talk at a 45 degree angle as I'm doing. If I were to talk right into the microphone and say puh words, I would vibrate the capsule inside the microphone and create rather terrible recordings. Let's look at those. Okay, so getting rid of pops, we can do that in many ways. Peter Piper picked a peck. So first of all, we can marquee select and just brash delete those low frequencies here using spectral frequency, and that can work quite effectively. Peter Piper picked a peck. It's done quite well, but it's quite aggressive. We can also use the paintbrush tool and we just paint out those little pops like that. And we can hold down shift to select multiple pops, hit delete like that, and that helps soften it up. 